So to put decals on your car, you're simply just going to go to Insert, Decal. I then go Insert from My Computer. Now go to, it's well for me it says the Student Resources, the R Drive. I think for you guys it says Curriculum R. So make sure you go to the R Drive, you go to STEM and STEAM, and then either the Year 7 or Year 8 F1 program folder. So go to Year 8 one, and there's a folder that says High Quality Decals. If you click into that, you've got all of them here. Now, if you just download the decals of the REA website, they're quite pixelated, so I've made sure that these are high resolution. So for you, you probably want to use the F1 in Schools decal, the A and B are for the race cars. So for you guys, you probably want to just use a display car for this one. So click on that and go open. Now I can select the surface. So I can click on the side pod. And I'm just going to move my screen around. All right, now, this decal is not to the correct size. Okay, it needs to be 30 by 15 millimeters. And this is too small. So I'm just going to press OK for now. And what we can do is we can start a sketch on this surface as well. All right, and I can make a rectangle just randomly. So maybe set up here and go 30, tab 15, enter. All right, so that sketch is how big my decal should be and it will be in real life. So if I grab that sketch and I'll just move it around Let's say I want the sketch to be, uh, sorry, the decal to be there. All right, you could also do dimensions and say, all right, well, from the bottom of the car from here to here, yeah, maybe you want one mil there, and maybe from the front of the side pod to here, maybe we could do the same, make it one mil. All right, so you know that if you do this on the other side, it'll be exactly the same. All right, we go finish sketch. Now that will stay there as a bit of a guide for you. So when I go to the decal section here, you might have to open up the little folder and right click on the, uh, the decal there. We can go edit decal. Now I can grab this section here and scale it up. So you can keep scaling it until it's pretty much the right size. So I'm pretty happy with that there. It's pretty close. I can press OK. All right, and then obviously I can delete the sketch that I no longer need. Okay, so that's how you get the decal. As you can see, it's high quality. It looks quite clean. All right, the ones that I've used previously in the past year, like I said before, is quite um, quite pixelated. You're going to also need a decal here as well. So once again, you can start a sketch. We'll rotate it around, and we are going to use a rectangle tool. Once again, make one here that's 15 by 30. And once again, you'd probably want to put dimensions on this to make sure it's in the middle. All right, but yeah, we'll go to insert, decal. And we could use the REA decal for this one. All right, select this surface. Right, so there might be a little bit of playing around to get the sizes correct. I'm going to scale that down. All right, and then use that sketch as a guide. So you want to get it yeah, as close as possible. So let's say I'm happy with that. Press OK. Once again, delete your sketch. Awesome. Now, I might want to put another decal up here. So same process. I'm going to go insert decal. And this one might be the Department of Defense. So go open, choose this face. All right, just roughly in the middle. And for this one here, you might just want to use it, maybe use this decal here as a guide on roughly how big it needs to be. So I would say maybe a touch smaller, maybe roughly about that sort of size. Just press OK. All right, if you wanted to, you could start a sketch up here. Um, so for me, if I was to do that, I would go offset from um, offset from plane, maybe select the bottom of the car, drag it up to the top, and then start a sketch on that plane. 
Now from here, you can, once again, use the rectangle tool. We can go 30, oh, sorry, 15, tab 30. And once again, you can use that as a guide. So obviously you can see mine's just a touch too big. So we'll go finish sketch. I can go back to that decal, go edit decal and just bring that in just a touch. Awesome. All right, just remember, always delete those sketches that you use as a guide. Cool, so that's all you need. So you need to have the, the Department of Defense, you need to have REA, and you need to have the F1 in schools decal on one side, plus the other side here as well. Okay, so make sure you get at least those in. If you've got sponsors for your team, obviously you can add them to the car. So obviously you probably have one here, one here, uh, maybe on the back as well. All right, and for the competition now, you also need to have a uh, number for your car. All right, so normally you put the number pretty much in between where the wheels are, roughly around here where the mouse is. So keep that in mind too.